I would not be worth you all paying attention to when you study me in your classes. If, amidst all the successes of my life, the Declaration of Independence, the Presidency, the Louisiana Purchase, if when I made a mistake, I didn't admit it. Never pay attention to someone very close if they won't admit they made a mistake, and you're not worth me having someone pay attention to you if you don't admit you made a mistake. I failed that. There, I could list things like the, the conflict over the Louisiana Purchase, over my argument with Alexander Hamilton and the differences of philosophy that are involved in that, but I think that's more important is that they learn about me, that though that they must learn about my life and time to understand America, that one of the most important messages I try to, to, to put forward to students is that each generation stands on the shoulders of those who have come before. General Washington and I were fighting in New York to defend us against the invading British. I was captain of artillery at the time. New York is my state, you know. I'm allowed to think that being from New York is anything to wreck that man's Nobody asked you. Uh, education is vital. When it, it, the people, of course, the passions of people, the very often they will either purposely or accidentally sacrifice the greater good to their individual animosity, to their individual avarice. Uh, in order to educate the people, you need a, a strong central government which can, which can do so, and thus they can give back to that federal government. When and why did Mr. Hamilton, did you and I begin hating each other? We still have a lot of things to learn about, and and there's a lot of things that went on in our lifetime that um, that we still have to study. I was kind of embarrassed at first, but I learned a lot from them. I learned more about how presidency was back then, and like how they debated and all that. You don't exactly get to have this happen every day. It's kind of like a once in a lifetime sort of experience. So, I mean, they teach you a lot more than the books do because you actually get to interact with them. It feels like you're actually getting it from the real person and not, we're not just reading from books. And I hope that students study our lives, learn the mistakes we made, uh, learn about successes and how we did it so they can, they can draw from that, those lessons. But then most importantly, I hope that they learn that a government by the people means that people have to think for themselves. Government. 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 Government.